beer or vodka. Forty percent. What do you think of this? Have you ever tried this? Nope. No. Nope. First time right here. First time. Okay, we're gonna open this up. We're gonna let these sit out for about 10 minutes. And then we'll get back to the review. Okay, we're back. We let this sit for about 15 minutes. Uh, you wanna try smell first? Yeah, it does actually have a. It's totally smell. Yeah, rubbing alcohol can smell already. Yeah. It's a potato vodka. Normally, I do like these potato ones more, but I'm sure. It doesn't smell. Like it's gonna be smooth. No, nope, that's for sure. <laughs> it's a fifty-dollar bottle, so hopefully it's worth decent. fifty bucks. Alright, let's taste. Oh, it's smooth. At first, yeah, smooth. Yeah. Put it on for a little bit. Aftertaste is there, yeah. A little bitter aftertaste, yeah. Yeah, the beginning and the middle is really smooth. Yeah, it's smooth. actually really nice. It's a lot. Yeah. I thought it was going to be a lot harsher when you first tried, but it's. That's going to be okay. It's at the end that you do get the yeah. a little bit of the rub and alcohol taste, but it's more of a you feel good it's you like a spice and there's like some sort of spices in it. Yeah. Yeah. What would you give this out of ten? For the strongness or? Uh, just the review overall. About six. Yeah, you don't really like vodkas, or? No, I'm a rum guy. I'm a stick, but I'll stick to my rum, no matter what. For a vodka, I'd give it about an eight. Cause it is pretty good. It's smooth. It's the non-flavored vodka. For non-flavored, it's actually pretty good and smooth. Overall, for all liquors, I think. Maybe a seven. Yeah, a that's ten. what I was thinking. Yeah, a seven. Yeah, because I do like rum more. No, yeah, I love rum. Whiskey and stuff. Rum to die. But for a fifty dollar bottle, I definitely think it's a uh, worthy of picking up. Try it out, and we'll see you guys in the next review. For last week's video, click here, and next week's video, click above. Okay. Or on chat. Oh, my